Broadway Boulevard in Kansas City's Midtown, a bustling drive-by thoroughfare, but a new salon co-working space hopes you'll stop by and relax. We've talked a lot about density and accessibility, walkability. There's just so much within a small amount of space, and I'd love to see Kansas City continue to grow and thrive. Moss Salon and Studios is still under construction, but when it opens, salon professionals can rent their own space without the overhead cost. We wanted to take that blow for entrepreneurs here in the urban core to make sure that they didn't have to do that because that is one of the biggest steps that someone has to take when opening up their own business. Creating a space like this and giving people the opportunity to start their own business with one to two thousand uh, dollars is is a hand up in your career. You can actually grow yourself, you can grow your business, whether it's, it's selling products or services. Houston says cutting out that cost for some stylists could mean avoiding being priced out of a city they love. We realized how much it takes to revitalize a, a space. Um, it's one of the reasons rents are going up across the metro and it's a real problem for small businesses. Many salons offer a chair for stylists they choose to hire, but Moss wants to give salon professional space for their own businesses. We wanted to make sure that there was common space so that other people, other clients, other renters, other stylists can collaborate, can go out, can have a good time, can work. You know, all of these different connectors that make a city great. Sheree Honeycutt, Fox 4 News.